Hey everyone, D here. Welcome back to another SML reaction video. Today I will be reacting, well, uh, technically tonight, I will be reacting to an SML movie Jeffy's Piercing. I kinda am very confused to what even made Jeffy want to get his ears pierced, but I guess we'll find out in a moment. Also, where I am, it's like very late at night, around 2 in the morning, so I will try my best. Like, I'm going to have to be quiet during this reaction because uh, my brother's kids are sleeping in the back, and if I'm too loud, it'll probably disrupt the video, and I'll have to redo it, just so you guys know. So, thank you for understanding and let's begin the reaction. What? It's not with those type of pipes. They're for toys and stuff. And arts and crafts. Seriously? Your ear pierces? Even I noticed that. Uh, he's so blind. <coughs> he did that on purpose. Knowing your dad, he's obviously going to say no. Exactly. Well, 17 is still close. I mean, there's some parents who let their kids do it. A good question. Ha, <laughs> <laughs> he made it in pipe cleaners. That's hilarious. Wait, what? That is not how that works. I don't get it. Wait, blood effects? Oof. Not funny, Jeffy. That's a girl's earring. Also, it's too big. Gosh, I thought... I thought they were going to add the same earring as his but no it had to be a big one fatality Well, that's what you get for ignoring him. Not that kind of sticky. Ugh, he was... You need glue. Ugh. No, you need hot glue. Tape isn't gonna work either. Ugh. 
Are you kidding? He says, Bowser, and I'm going to tell yo daddy when he tries getting him in trouble. I'm sure he's going to do the same for Jeffy. Just you watch. Ew. That looks nothing like soup. Ew, we dropped it in. This is the soup. Trust me, you don't want that after his ear fell in. How is that even a rule? That's selfish. Okay, first of all, you're not a woman, you're a man, and you're not beautiful. You're overweight. Your butt, belly button shows, you have horns on your head, a scar on your left eye, and you don't even work. And you wear bunny slippers. Just tell him there's an ear in it. Ew. Are you kidding? Well, your dad just committed an accidental act of cannibalism. You mean potato head? Oh, oh, I get it. To avoid Pixar Disney copyright. Okay, I get it. They didn't even take it. How did Jeffy take it? Can't skip it. Yes, you could tell. It's completely pink. I knew that was her ear. I mean, I knew that was a lady's earring. <sighs> oh, they know. Please stop talking like that. Ugh. Well, it wouldn't have happened if you'd stay out of his business. <laughs> it's Bowser. You don't even know what happened, so you don't know. Ew, he actually... <laughs> what? Right what? I don't get it. Oh, does it have to be him? No, no, D does it have to be this guy? No, no, P please have Brooklyn here. That's not what he meant. It's not, he's not missing his ear, it's right there. Well, 
No. He's probably really gonna F this up bad. Wait, what is that yellow stuff on it? No. What is that green stuff on his ear? Are you kidding? He didn't even put it on right. And what is that green stuff on it? Just do it. Oh, okay, that's what it meant. What is the most painful thing to ever happen to you? Hmm. To be honest, I don't really know. But there is one recent thing. Uh, last year, I got into some fights with this guy. He's really weird, and he would often come around bothering me. It all started when I was just minding my own business, skateboarding across the sidewalks, and then this guy, like, I, I passed their sidewalk of their house one time, just having fun, and he hated it, and has ever since been trying to just make my day bad by harassing me, attacking me, etc. And one time, he tried taking my skateboard away from me, I tried fighting him back for it, and then he threw the skateboard at my right arm and I it left a really big scar and I still have it but it's kind of faded now and that was kind of the worst day ever and my grandparents were really angry with me that I didn't even tell them I didn't even know what to say but at the same time I mean, you gotta at least admire my bravery sometimes. I mean, come on. Not everybody would fight back for what's taken from them. Uh, I mean, you know, I mean, not everybody would fight back for what's taken away from them. And I couldn't just let him take away what I owned. He even did it with my shoe, and he burned it. And threw it in a porta potty. So yeah, but the shoe isn't isn't at least as painful as the skateboard incident when I was fighting him for it. And yeah, that was kind of the most painful thing to ever happen to me, at least from recent events. And that was like last year in May. So yeah, that was the most painful thing to happen to me. I still don't like him to this day, and if I ever see him again, there will be problems, because I'm still kind of angry about my shoe. I mean, I'm trying to forget about it, but he's going to get what's coming to him. And if not by me, then somebody will help me get back at him. I try not to, but that can't be forgiven like make giving me a scar can't be forgiven i forgive him at times but something like that that's just crossing the line well yeah so anyways that was that was the reaction to jeffy's piercing so my rate for this one I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Mainly because I just it I just hated the fact that uh Jonathan had to be in this episode. Like because usually Brooklyn TI is mainly the one dealing with this stuff because he's a more competent worker, despite being a little silly at times. He's still kinda 
way better at his job than Jonathan. And I'm kind of disturbed by his suggestive jokes targeted towards people's wise and stuff because I don't I didn't even get it and first of all what was up with Jeffy's ear and why was it green or yellow or whatever that stuff was and he said success what is that even supposed to mean like I really don't know but then he brings it back didn't even put it on properly and the next thing we see is some yellow stuff we don't even know what it is or how it got there. But if any of you know, I would really like your comment because I'm so curious to what that yellow stuff is on his ear because I just don't trust this dude to do anything for anybody. But anyways, yeah, that was the reaction. Have a good night.